Good morning. Yesterday I discovered a strange error that was during the flashing of Android 11 to my Samsung Galaxy S3. And I fixed it, but I'm sure that many people will run into this error. And it's as well because of what we tell you to do whenever you're gonna install one of these latest ROMs. So even though the phone is fixed again and it's working, running and up, uh, I'm gonna go back to the brick. We're gonna break this phone and I'm gonna explain why the brick is happening and that it's not your fault. It's not the fault of your phone, but it's the fact, in fact, the fault of a development that went wrong. Okay, so uh, we're gonna flash Android 11. So I upgraded my twerp as well to the latest and that is 3.4. As you can see there, twerp 3.4. And we're gonna do a normal wipe. And we're gonna flash the ROM. Hey, what is that? Failed to map file. Hmm, strange error. And we're on the latest work, 3.4. So when you get this error, you might think that something is, is wrong with your phone, because you as well try to flash some older ROM, 7.12, uh, that worked fine on this phone and you get the same error how to fix this is crazy so you'll be scratching your head and be like hey but wait a minute i'm trying to flash 7.12 that worked fine on this phone but you then realize suddenly that you upgraded the twerp because you did not need the latest version of twerp to run that Android that you were running. In my case, that was the EROM 7.12 Nougat. Um, so you then start thinking that maybe it could be the twerp. Because what else could it be? You know, I mean, the phone was just fine. Uh, I even, I even went and formatted data. You know, and that, that process is a process if it goes wrong there during the, you know, when you type yes and it's going to format data and the phone reboots and some crazy things happen after that, you know, you suddenly cannot get, then you are really messed because then your NAND drive is probably broken. However, the format data went just fine. You know, no red lines, no, I even went and, 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 you know, fixed the, the, the system partition formatted to X2 and then back to, to X4, you know, nothing. So I thought it must be twerp. It, it, it just it cannot be nothing else. So then I downgraded the twerp. So let's take a look at that process and then you're going to understand the problem even better because uh, twerp 3.4 for the i9300 but this could as well be for any other phone out there that get this error, this particular error, you know. Most of the times it has to do with the twerp that you installed. In this case, we should install 3.4 because that is the latest. However, 3.4 has in fact a problem. It's It should be taken off uh, twerp.me and it should be repaired. Somebody should take a look at it because it's not working on the S3. So now I'm gonna downgrade the twerp and you're gonna see that everything will be just fine. Okay, here you can see that, um, let's go home, that I already updated the twerp. Here I'm running 323, okay? So I can confirm that this, this version works, alrighty? And how to install or how to upgrade or downgrade you must know already because you did it right you you downloaded the the image and then you hit it install and then you select it here to install image and um if i go where i think so go here i should have them you see that and there are the images uh, the 3.4 
is, is, yeah, is breaking. In fact, yeah, it's not working. And the 323, I just installed. You select it like that. Oh, even een terug. Install, upper level. Waar is hij nou weer naartoe? De, uh, hè? Huh? Oh ja, image. And then you select the image, of course. And then you select recovery. You swipe. And then you reboot, you go back home, and then you reboot back into recovery. I'm not gonna do any of that, okay? Because I already flashed the room. And I'm gonna show you that uh, this works. Okay, though, we're back. We're in 323 now. And I wiped my internal drive completely, formatted data, all these things. Did that. Was not needed, totally not needed, but I didn't know. I was still researching the problem. Um, so, yeah, we can now go ahead and install Lineage OS 18. And there you go, peeps. It's installing. No more error. And that thanks to the downgrade to 323. So, as you can see, even in Android world, upgrades are not always the best thing in the world. Eh? So... Yeah, when something is working good, the App Store or <laughs> even your Aurora or F-Droid Store will ask you to or will tell you that there is an update available. And then you go updating that thing and then suddenly the app doesn't work anymore the way you always wanted to see it work. So and then suddenly you're dealing with, with, with a strange thing happening on your and you, and you and you regret, you know, the upgrade. So... In this case, there was nothing to regret because it gave the impression that uh, something was, was wrong with the phone or with the file and you start copying files 10 times to your SD card. You, you, you even think that your SD card is not good, so you go and buy another SD card. <laughs> you know, all these crazy things just because of one twerp that is not working good, at least. Maybe it works good, but... No, it's not, because I was as well trying um, to then, under 3.4, um, install EROM. And EROM installs always fine to my phone, you know, no problem at all with EROM. EROM is just amazing. But as you can see, even with EROM, I was getting that same error. So I was getting that error with every ROM, so something is not good about that twerp okay so this is showing it uh, the problem on the s3 but this could be on any other android phone because the problem is not with the phone the problem is not with you the problem is not with the rom but the problem is with twerp so let me reboot my phone back to system before i do crazy things mm -hmm. so yeah um the phone is is running and up and i could show you in my previous video android 11 you know by chrono and his friends not to forget about renando as well you know uh, android 11 for the s3 i9300 even though it's not done yet and even though um it must be uh, improved it's uh, it's already very usable and you can use it to make phone calls and to browse the internet and to enjoy Android 11 on your classic Samsung Galaxy S3. More about that in the previous video under this one. To find my videos, just go to my, my, my main channel, hit click on my name, and then click on my video list, and then you're gonna find all the videos. And if you look for a particular model, just you know type the, the model name in, in the search of my video list, and then, then you should find uh, the videos that correspond with your questions well that was it ladies and gentlemen i want to thank you for watching on this sunday sunday morning and see you then in the next video that will bring a distro to the radio amateurs uh, i i created a, a ham radio linux yeah distribution a very light one 64 bit by the way will run on these older 64 bit devices so uh, we're gonna uh, as well 
if I take a look at that distribution and I already uploaded it so it will be really easy for you to download it's 1.6 gigabytes and you can run it live from a USB stick great for radio amateurs great for pilots great for Marines uh, great for everybody that love to listen to classic radio you know real radio AM radio like radio that was broadcasted through the air and then catched by a receiver and thanks to amazing to technology sent to the internet so you know this particular group of people can then you know experience the real thing but then on their computer thanks to the internet connection so that and more in my next video so make sure to subscribe please uh, Hit notifications so you'll be updated whenever I upload a new video again. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. I'm out. Signing out. Channel 48. Goodbye.